happening, yo? What's good? How's it going? What's poppin'? It's your boy, No Life. Uh, we back at it again. Another stream. We're back on Sable today. And, um, for today. Um, uh, yeah. One, Merry Christmas, everybody. And, um, again, like last stream, I want to begin off with, um, you know, the best wishes to Palestine and, um, goodness, I need to do some research and be able to send people to the proper, um, avenues to help. So, freedom for Palestine, you know, return to their land and, um, a ceasefire if there isn't already one. I also don't be on the news like that, but I kind of, I know that's going on, and I know that's not good, so. Ow. <clears throat> but any, any, uh, and on that note, I'd like to get back to the gaming for a quick moment. What we got here is, uh, uh, you know, uh, our trial. I forgot how wonderful this game was. My goodness. But uh, we got this trial here, so we're gonna go ahead and just get it started, you know? I think we're gonna get a new mask or something? Maybe. I think that's kind of the... Uh, I like this game. I think this game is going to be very entwined with my spiritual awakening and journey. And uh, with that, I'll be able to share some insight. I have no idea what just popped up. I didn't see where it went. up with the statue real quick. That's a big lady. Looks like I need a thing for this big lady. Let's get you something for that big lady. Um, so, the vibe today has been isolation. Which is, you know, for me personally, Crap. You know, it's 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 not the thing you'd usually hear on a Christmas day, you know. No, I spent some time with family yesterday, so that was cool. Also, it made me realize just how much um, I need my isolation. And not only in the mind, but in like my energy as well. Or, like Not only in the physical space, but in like, my energy as well. You know, I need to, I need to, I need to get, I need to pull the pieces of myself back together. Which is quite true.
crap. stamina every game uh, you know what I think I think that's a great lesson I need to learn as well uh, I need to take my rest seriously I need to take my uh, alone time my solace serious it's serious me time right there that's serious time for me to gain insight and wisdom so that I can be a part of the community and collective in a positive way. There another one of these things. That's gone. Interesting. Get a high vantage point. There's a nice orange rock there. But um, I've been coming to this. I, you know what? I didn't. I didn't even see it. I've been coming to this uh, conclusion. For it's also been light that's been shed upon me from from past friendships and um, connections. Um, my judgmentalness. This one don't got a mask. This must be where this mask came from. This must be like the first mask. Trial completion fit. Yeah, you love to see it. Yeah, you. And, um, yeah. You know what? I'm really not one for capes, but if you add a hood to it, then I don't, I'm not, I, don't, I have no problem, sir. It's a little, it's a little bit of a, it's a little. J -j -j inside of my body at the moment, but hey, you know, here. But hey, I feel like I'm putting on a new, a new mask, you know? Like, not that I want to wear a mask or... Um, I don't know. Be, uh... Where's my ride? Uh. I 
probably should have done that from the top of the thing. But look at this, you know, look at look at what we got going on here. I feel like but I didn't continue on the judgment thing. I judge myself and it me brought to my attention that I'm being judgmental and made me realize that I can't keep that solely to myself. I end up judging other people too. And that's not something I don't do because with my logic and understanding, it's there's no reason to judge anybody else. Everybody's living their life. They're on their own path. They're on their own journey. And, you know, it's, it's really none of my business. And... I don't know. All life is beautiful. So it's like there's no reason to judge. And yet I find myself still dealing with my own negativity, uh, shadow self, and negative thoughts, and those judgments. And I'm a quiet person, so for the most part, I don't really share anything but really. I don't know, uh, affirmations, so. Yeah. I feel like it's people feeling my energy, because I'm not the only person who's empathetic or feels intuitive, so. I feel like it's people feeling into my energy and it's honestly my own boundaries and my own sense of cleansing and healing that's kind of I don't know not irritating but um, it's irritating that I haven't built my boundaries stronger than that to then to or I haven't healed enough and isolation noticing that I need isolation but feeling like that's not the normal thing to do or that's not the like buddy buddy thing to do or um, friendly thing to do it's a very selfish thing and yeah But much like Sable, I guess we all have to embark on our own journeys. And for me, I feel like that's being on my own for a period of time. It's not even a feeling, it's like a knowing, but it's like I'm fighting against it. So I want to surrender to that. But anyway, what's, what's Johnny talking about? Well, Sable, this is it. By the time you hear this, we will have gone. The gliding is a journey that must begin alone. There's a certain nuance lost in transmission, and for that I'm grateful. It would be far too much to hear the cracks in her voice and not run weakly into her arms to stay forever. But I'm ready. And so I close my eyes and listen. But though you go by yourself, you are not without friends. You are not without family. You are not without love. These things you will always carry with you as you do your mass. And I know, I'm not, and I know, I'm not supposed to do this, but if I were you, I might just go see Utari. They're a machinist at Burnt Oak at Burnt Oak Station, and among Sizzle's closest friends, Utari's a good contact to have on one's gliding, and a fine way to get another machinist badge if you're so inclined. Only a suggestion, though. As for us, I'll send another message once we've returned to the Uwas, Ewas, Ewas, Ew, Ewers. So keep an eye on the post boxes and try not to forget us. She takes a long breath, and I forget that things as and I forget that things as easy as breathing could ever exist. The world is waiting, Sable. Good luck.
Hey, you. Yeah. What you mean? Ain't it clean? Shouts out to see moon. In a dream, know what I do. Oh, pull up in my cool. Oh, yeah, run it up. Oh, yeah, I'm in a boo. Oh, 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 what you do? Hold on, we going over here. I ain't acting in a loop. Oh, I just wanna heal. Uh, baby, what you want? What you wanna deal? I was like, whoa, donuts, heal. Yeah. 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 You, you see me? This way. Oh, this, this, and it slaps. And I'm finna cry, and it slaps. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like everything just moving in time. Hey, this morning time, so I gotta respect my mind. Uh, my mind. I wanna go to the past and rewind. Stop trying to rewind. Just trying to live life. Trying to find my. Trying to find myself blame. Ain't no much to blame. Ain't no one to blame. Just stay in my lane. And I guess this is the part where the feeling is here and here and they feel like I've been a victim of never been in a minute. Goodness. Everything trying to find. I really try to find witness. And maybe this is trying to find business. I really up on that. Feeling like a month to the same cup month, but I really been really stuck on that. You know, I ain't like this got fried up, you know, like the dust don't come This ash, the ash, the past, the gases, you know, I ain't smashing, smashing, smashing. And then she was passing. You know, or she was I don't wanna pat it. I don't wanna pat it. I just want peace. I feel the music for the planet. Yeah, yeah, could you hack it? Do um, you wanna understand it? Yeah, I'm like Poyo. Uh, looking like Kirby. Looking like Poco. Yo. Mm, yeah, I'm too nerdy. Dang, damn, that was a slap. Alright, I didn't, I didn't, you know what, didn't really like my freestyle there, but you know what, there, there'll be better freestyles, and I'm not in the best, I just was like, might as well. But anywho, it looks like we're about to get to this spot, you feel me, you know, we're, 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 we're here, we're at a destination. I'm really liking Simoon here, Simoon, you feel me, is chilling. We're at Burnt Oak Station. What's in here? Anything of interest? Oh gosh, I'm stuck. Howdy, brother. It is a challenge not to view scrapers through quite a romantic lens. Oh goodness. As I look, as I look toward my gliding as a child, I pictured myself as a dust-covered traveler, exploring strange, forbidden places, and finding strange, forgotten things. A treasure hunter of old and arcane objects. And though I'm certain the grind of sifting through sand and dirt for useful tools and things left over can wear anyone down. I cannot help but weave some thread of my fantasy into the reality of the work. I wasn't speaking from. I was trying to use this guy's. This is this. That's this guy's voice. 
I get. Greetings, glider. I'm Atlin. I I give a bow and introduce myself as Sable. You find much scrap metal out there, Sable. Yeah, yeah you know, it's been known to happen. Good, good. Adlin leans back and looks up at the ceiling thoughtfully. Got a task for you then, if you're up for it. The hesitation in my voice is a product of a gentle intimidation, but I stand up straight and casual enough to seem like I'm up for anything. Adlin seems to believe it enough. Ooh, I need scrap. I need scrap, Sable. A lot of it. And you out there already. Doing basically nothing. Atlin chuckles to himself. Shouldn't say it like that. Gliding's odd. Uh, you have nothing to do, so you have everything to do. Wonder if anyone's ever spent their gliding just lying around. Yeah, I don't know if that counts as gliding. I say with a smirk that I don't imagine that would count as gliding, but at the same time I wonder if some people do go out and use the time to simply be with themselves in a safe and reflective space. Would it matter as much what mask we choose if we found our purpose deep within? Oh no, I should be doing that. Adlin clears, Adlin clears his throat and I'm grateful to be shaken free. Anyhow, the task. Goodness gracious, I'm getting, I gotta read. Anyhow, the task. Let's see if you can understand this one, yeah? It's a bit complex. I tell him I'm ready. Go out, find scrap, bring it to me. Slightly taken aback, I ask Atlin if that's all. What do you mean is that all? That's scrapping. You want the job or not? For sure, I'll, I'll bring him. I'll bring him back scrap. Go get my scrap guy. Do I have any scrap on me right now? Is any scrap on me? How do I die my bike? Come on, I need to die my bike now. My my hood and cape is red. The stone inside is red. Come on. Well, I guess it changes colors, but when it stops, it's red. I mean, it's that green now. It must mean go, huh? But the jet stream is red. Come on. Burnt Oak Station. Look at these guys' wings. These guys' sand cutters. They're pretty cool. They're pretty fly. I can't lie. Whoa, hey. All right, let me just park it right here. Come on, come on, just just park it. It's no problem. Just park it. Okay, there we go. I need to find somebody. You will tell me where I need to know. I'm perfectly on time. I don't know what you mean. No, I tell them yes. They at least consider it. Uh, no, you're late. Perplexed. I wait for them to explain themselves, but they seem to wait for the same. Briefly, I hit a, briefly, I feel a hint of shame as I remember times I've been late among the Avexi. Things I've slipped up on in doing. Things I've slipped up in doing. But I dismiss my doubts as I recall that I have no idea who this strange machinist is, and I, I ask them. My name is Utari. Of immediate relevance to you that is, is is that I'm a friend of Sizzle. I asked then if Sizzle alerted th them to my impending arrival. Perhaps she looks out for me and sets waypoints and oasis along my gliding. A comforting thought. No, no, no. It was your hover bite. I heard it for the first time months ago. It felt the shape of its voice. Her voice. Sorry. I tell Lutari that. It was not C Moon they heard, for Sizzle and I only built her a few days hence. They waved their hands at me in hurried dismissal. Did, te did, did, did Sizzle teach you so, so little? The voices of our machines are eternal, more ancient even than their forms. I hear them, 
as I always have, and yours, I thought would revisit me sooner. But here we are. Now let us speak of why you have come. Our needs converge atop the wind tower. Okay, tell me more. Some t something has stopped the tower working. Something has stopped the tower working. I feel like that's off somehow, but I don't know how. <laughs> I was hours away from going to see it for myself, but you and Samoon came after all. Go there, mend what is broken, or soothe what is hurt, and I'll give you what you seek. I ask Guitar if they know what I seek, I admit that I might not. A direction. I will be waiting for you to travel swiftly and safely. I say goodbye to Atari. Make it red. How do I make it red? Might as well check out what else is over here, you know? I mean, hey, before we head out. Yeah, I'm in your house. What's going on? The mass caster sits unmoving, silent. I can't tell if the mass caster is human or something else. I've heard about the mass casters and stories about glidings before. Gliders should collect three badges of, of a set and bring them to the caster from whom the mask shall be cast. I should look for more for some more badges. I'll leave the I'll leave the mask caster. All right, let me get him another machinist badge, and then another machinist badge, and then come back over here. But at least now I know that's where I need to go. I'm sure I would have had a mission that would have told me. Is that a beetle? Glider, welcome. Come view my wares. Merchants aren't liable to just give out badges for for, 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 for uh, freely. Your best bet. There is to head to a carrier. Carrier. There's a big market in town there, worth trying to Erie's attention. If you want to get there yourself, some merchants' badges. Be careful. <laughs> this man, this man has a seizure mid-sentence constantly. Be careful how you do it. Mind, she's not the friendliest customer. <laughs> See you soon. <laughs> Why do I feel dumber for having had that conversation? Or talking like that. What's going on? I mean, Ifa, the innkeeper of the camp. Ifa, <laughs> darn you, game grumps. What can I do for you? Do you have any time going before I can even finish the question? Ifa shouts, "Larval Heist." I repeat the words back to her as clarification. She nods. I need some larval husk there. How much do you know about beetles? Um, a little bit. Well, not sure if this part of that. Well, not sure if this is part of that little bit, but larval husk are what gets left behind when the beetle larvae grow. Beautiful, really tough casing. If you don't mind, I'd be grateful if you could collect some for me. 
the type I'm looking for are Hercules beetles. You won't need to go far, but the nest is guarded by the mother beetle. You're going to have to find a way to get past her. I'll tell her I'll do my best. Anything else I can help you with? Uh, no, peace out. You know, it's pretty, pretty straightforward. I thought you were a uh, display, my brother. The guard before me stands. The guard before me stands tall. Her posture shaped by duty. Uniform. That's a woman. Uh, her posture shaped by duty. Uniform weathered by years. Hello there, young glider. I near. I'm nearly startled by the force of her greeting, but her voice is comforting somehow, warm and welcoming. I greet her with the accidental enthusiasm of a traveler finding a friend. She smiles behind the mask, I think. Always nice to meet a fellow adventurer. Especially now. How are you faring so far? The world is big and I feel very small. I need sleep. Don't we all? But don't you feel lucky that you made a bed under the stars? I think about the balled up fabric and smoothed out rock that will make me up my next pillow. And many to come, my neck aches faintly at the thought of how many nights I'll spend this way. It's impossible, I'm romanticizing it already. It's it's possible, I'm romanticizing it already. You see, I'm getting ready to leave from on my second gliding. She reads the confusion in my silence. Did no one tell me of the second gliding? I suppose it isn't a real a real a real second gliding, but it's how I'm thinking about it. A chance to see the world again and how it's changed. I'm an Ecrine guard, you see, or I was an Ecrine guard as of three days ago. I'm officially retired. You should have seen the way the others looked at me. There's a laugh in her voice. All of them were so baffled to see me go. I tell them how much I'd missed the big city. A few of them even felt sorry for me. Like I would, like what would I do now that my life's purpose is complete? Can you imagine? I try to, but I can barely muster a view of my purpose to start, and let alone its end. I shake my head. I said, I said thank you all for the strange co condolences, but tomorrow's, tomorrow marks the first time in decades that I'll wake up in the morning and have absolutely no idea what lies ahead, and I've never been more excited. Don't get me wrong, I love my work. I even love the noise and the trouble of carrying. But I've spent enough of my life standing around looking hard. It's time to explore. Her glee is infectious. I ask where she'd like to go. I'm heading to the Badlands, I think. I want to see the Bridge of the Betrayed. If you haven't already, you should definitely go and see it. See it yourself. You'll want the northern. You'll want. You'll want the the northern Badlands, southwest of here. I'm not trying to keep the directions in mind, and Elizabeth gives me a little tap maybe I'll see you up there well okay Ooh, what is this who are you well isn't that interesting not a talker, I see. Am I tweaking or was her face tweaking? Not much of a talker either, I see. No unread messages. No unread messages. No unread messages. Now where do we gotta go? Oh, now where do we gotta go? Oh, 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 oh where do we gotta go? Oh, 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 oh. oh, oh where do we Gotta go. Oh, oh, where do we gotta go? Oh, 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 where do we gotta go? I don't know, baby, what's without a care? Oh, 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 oh
This mysterious plant I see. Pineapple. Pineapple. Okay, well I think I think uh I'm gonna take care of this mission next time. Next time on the live no life show with no life. This is the no life show. Uh, you know uh, it's probably You know what? It might be KL with KL. No life with no life. Alright. Next time on KL. KL. KLXKL. Because I'm a Hunter Hunter fan. <laughs> the KL KL show. Um, up there. Uh, to higher heights than we've ever seen before. Alright. You guys have a good one. Goodbye.